Now we go to Rexburg, where tonight the city council hosted a public forum to discuss vaping among kids. Eyewitness News reporter Tyler Berg is live for us in Rexburg tonight. Tyler, this concern was raised just pretty recently, in fact. Uh, remind us why. Yeah, Madison Junior High and Madison High have found that more students are using e-cigarettes or vape pens. And parents, well, they want to know more about it. And that's what tonight was all about. Three Rexburg police officers and Madison Junior High's principal answered questions on everything from the liquids used, how to talk to kids about vaping, and the legality of it. Anyone over 18 can vape. No one took issue with that. But again, this is something police say is gaining popularity with kids. And that's where this curiosity was born among Rexburg parents. Tonight it was just more of an informational meeting and, and presenting some of the challenges of having in junior high and high school with some of the kids and, and, and I wasn't aware that they were able to get this over online either. You know, that was one of the things I didn't know. One of the questions is where are these kids getting these e-cigarettes and vape pens if they're not 18? And one of the officers had mentioned that some junior high students had bought them from high school students for a lot of money. And some kids had even convinced their parents to buy them for them as a healthy alternative to cigarettes. Live in Rexburg tonight, I'm Tyler Berg. Hmm, all right. Tyler, thanks for the report there live from Rexburg. Uh, we stay in Madison County where more